let's see what today is going to bring us today. Oh my goodness. Spirit first says to me, pay attention to documents that you're signing. Make sure every T is crossed and every I is dotted so that there is no delay in the process of whatever it is that you're going through. And that for whatever reason, those things need to be signed. So just make sure that everything's been triple, quadruple checked before you send them on their way. Double check your work. Have someone else even look at it for you. Because often, you know, I am the queen of typos, let me tell you. I read right over them. I'm fluent in typo. <laughs> so if you need someone else to help you, don't be afraid to ask someone else to look over your documents before signing them or sending them on their way. What else do we have today? Let's see. Oh. The book without a cover. Hmm. The book without a cover. We have to just sometimes trust. Give ourselves the ability to sense and feel on that other level. Just pick it up and read it. You might be pleasantly surprised. A book without a cover. Hmm. That, what that shows me is that there's nothing there for us to make that judgment on, right? Don't judge a book by its cover. So if the cover was there, we'd be likely to be judging, wouldn't we? Hmm. It's just human behavior. This book has no cover, so we can't create those judgments against whatever it is. Hmm curious to see where in our lives that is going to come into play in the next few days but it's coming and you'll find that moment where you allowed yourself to be guided allowed yourself to feel and follow your intuition and it may be something that um you're not allowed to see the full picture. You are just asked to trust. So that would be like a book without a cover, right? You're not shown this particular thing, whatever it is. You're just asked to trust it. So you have to figure out whether or not you can trust it or not. And how do you do that if you don't exactly know what it is or you don't see it? Hmm. So you have to go in and allow your spirit to guide you and be intuitive about it. Now don't second guess yourself. You go with that first instinct. That's your intuition. So that book without a cover that's coming into your life, that moment or that thing that you're being asked to trust, this is your little test, your intuitive test to see how well and how connected you are to your intuition and how much you are allowing yourself to trust it. Go with that first feeling, thought, and instinct. That's the one that's going to be spot on. <laughs> if you have these moments this week, let me know. I'd love to hear your stories. Have a great day, everyone. Get outside, touch the earth, cleanse your space, do your meditations, and remember that this is why the wolf, the raven, and spirit, we are sending you unconditional love.